Hey guys, my name is Dave, and welcome to yet again another live video. I never thought I'd see the day where I'd be constantly doing live videos as much as I'm doing them right now. But there has been so much going on recently that unless I record it, like, in the moment, I am going to forget to talk about it. I don't know, I think it might alter what I was originally doing as far as, like, content goes, but we'll see. Um, like, the, the way I go about it, but I, I need to actually figure that out at some point. Anyway, that, I, I digress, that's not the topic I was going to bring up. This video, actually, I wanted to kind of talk about something that I, I felt was necessary to talk about because it ties into some recent events in my life that have happened. Not the events directly of what just I've been talking about for the past like four or five live videos, but more like this one's more to talk about something about me. There are many people out there who it, like everyone has flaws, everyone, but there are so many people out there who are like, no, I'm t I don't do that and that kind of stuff. I'm the kind of person who won't, or at least I, I strive not to. I am willing to admit flaws once they're pointed out, once it's been shown, that kind of stuff. One particular flaw for me specifically is that I have a tendency to when I do make mistakes and they're pointed out, and I feel like it's a drastic one that, in, that I can sense impacted the person in question, I'll start, not literally, but I will start like beating myself over it. I have done it in the past, and I keep on doing it. Now, when I say beating myself, I just mean like, I'll put myself down because of it. And that can last from 20 minutes to days. I don't think I've ever had a situation that lasted longer than five days before. Which, I could talk about it at a given point in time if... If effort ever necessary. No, now that I'm thinking about it, there have been some that lasted like months. Some things that have happened, that happened months ago as of like now that I still have not forgiven or forgotten myself where I still beat myself up for it. There is actually one situation that happened years ago, which I think I have talked about. Either way, I do end up beating myself up, up over this kind of stuff, and it's... I don't know if you can consider that a flaw or not. A lot of people I know do. Um, sometimes me doing this does bring me down. That's the flaw in it. And not, like, intentionally me trying to bring myself down. It's more like, as I'm thinking about it, I actually do get depressed over it. This doesn't always happen. But it does happen for me. This is probably the big, one of my biggest flaws, in my opinion. It leads me to misunderstand things, misinterpret things, and then when, it finally, when I'm finally in the mindset of understanding it, I... It's like a, it's like kind of a circular uh, effect where it's a butterfly effect. Domino effect? Basically, it's kind of like those, uh, this, uh, it's a cycle. That's the word I was looking for. It's a cycle. Gotta love doing these things improv. I never talk about these things, not. Impr I've never scripted any of these, as many of you may know. But that I digress. I. This is a flaw that I would both kind of like to fix, but at the same time, it is just part of who I am as a person, and it makes me part of me. It's not the best thing that can make me who I am, but it does help build the best thing. It, it, at least, I think so. I guess it's kind of the same mindset where, like, Punishment builds character, that kind of thing, except I do it to myself trying to build my own, I guess. That's probably not the best way to look at it or describe it, but that's... is kind of how it is for me. I, I... I don't know. This is a flaw that kind of did recently have a large impact. I'm not going to go too much into detail, but 
recently Silver and I were talking and we've kind of come to good terms again we're trying to work things out again as I already said um and she came to me like she started talk she she was talking about somebody who she had met um over the internet who she had become close friends with over that and I'm not going to reveal any details on what happened or anything like that, but they ended up stopping talking, and because of this, she came to me to tell me what was going on, and the location that where she met the person, I don't trust that location at all. It's also where she's met a couple other people who have bailed on her, or not bailed on her, she had to bail on them because of the reason that I don't trust the site or the people from the site up to the IRL point unless they can show me otherwise and none of them have so far but I explained this kind of thing and it turned into something I didn't want it to turn into which was basically a lecture off the bat you could probably already tell why it would sound like a lecture but that's not what the point I was trying to make was the fault in this was that I didn't immediately go I'm sorry I wish there was something more I could do for you, that kind of thing. And this is probably the more, most recent example of what I'm kind of referring to. And the reason I kind of, I felt like I, rather rather than doing, you know, two games today, like I normally do, just one live, one game, and then probably I might just continuously do that from here on, just one live, one game, just to balance things out a bit more. I don't know. We'll see. But... Again, the outcome that came from that, I let Silver go to recuperate her thoughts, and as I did, it was not hard for me to tell that I had made a big mistake in saying what I did, and I was like, I mean, even while talking, I realized this was a mistake, and I have, at this point, probably apologized with, like, within the time space of 30 minutes within the time space of 30 minutes I apologize maybe five or six times and I it shortened afterwards we talked for a little bit after that and by that time she was crying and I was like I'm the kind of person who can feel other people's pain and that hit me hard I sometimes I wish I could retract all these kind of actions and statements, but you know, there's no way to do it. And it's, I know it's technically like basically a learning curve when you make these kind of mistakes. It's just showing don't do it again, that kind of thing. But for me, it because this flaw has been going on for some time, maybe it'll be like the one detailed bit, but it, a repeat in a sense has been a problem for me. But that's a different flaw, kinda. Either way, I... That's another thing about me you just learned. I have flaws, and that is one of them. Um, this was kind of a bit of a downer video, so I'm sorry if you guys didn't really stick to it at all, or if you're still watching this, thank you. But I am going to leave this video here. Um, want to check out more videos that I talk about like either my history or how I'm like um, or if you want to check out a discussion and or rant that I've done um, I'll have the links to the two playlists of those on my sides I feel like I'm gonna hiccup it's a really bad time Whew. but if you do like this live kind of stuff where I'm like talking live um, as I said kind of off and on throughout this video, I'm probably going to start doing one every day, alongside a gaming footage, a gaming video as well. If you want to check that kind of stuff out, consider subscribing to the channel. I'll have a um, a well. I what was I going to say? I was going to say something. Else. I don't know what I was going to say. I lost my train of thought. But if you do want, just consider subscribing to the channel because I do one of these now every day. Um, wanna, ch uh, if you do want to check out some gaming stuff, though, this 
platform at this point probably has more of those than this. Um, but either way, I am going to head off. I need to recoup my thoughts before I start really beating on myself over something like this. But I'll catch you guys tomorrow in another one of these kind of videos. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys later. Bye for now.